week is a crazy week for me because oh my god finals is coming up if you're not in college or school right now lucky you you're awesome good for you but this video is for the people that are struggling if you're not in high school or college or middle school, I guess, I then you can still enjoy this video and watch it and watch me stress out and feel the stress of my thousand stresses. But if you are in school, I'm sorry for yelling at you. If you are in school right now, you're probably feeling the stress that I'm feeling unless you're just awesome, you know, unless you're just really cool, whatever. <laughs> but I am stressed to know other because I have finals coming up and <laughs> I have a final in every single class. So anyways, I'm gonna stop introing to this video and tell you ways to survive final week or test week or whatever, I don't know. Text message! Number one step to surviving finals. Don't have a social life. Pretty self-explanatory. Step two! Eat a whole lot because trust me, eating helps calm your stress down. <laughs> Step three, have a social life, kind of, by having study groups. It cancels out my first one. Like not have a social life, like hanging out with friends and like woo party. But like have a social life as in get together with people and study groups. Step four, you know, like golf. <laughs> By yourself. I don't know how else to tell you study because you're gonna need to study. If you don't study, you're gonna pass maybe, but you're not gonna get a fantastic grade that people are gonna be like, yay! Oh my god, I'm crazy right now. Step five! Breathe. Just. <sighs> I need to take my own advice on this one. <laughs> Don't miss any days of school because when tests are coming up, teachers are giving reviews and you want those reviews. I'm not kidding, you want those reviews because they help so much. They help so much. Step seven, try to stay away from social media. I can't even talk about that one, it's so hard. Step eight. Ask a teacher for help. Set up a study date with your teacher. Not a real date, because that's illegal. But a study date. Step nine! This might sound like the wrong thing to do, but take some time away from studying to make sure your mind's clear. Because if you study too hard, when you get there, you're gonna have so much overload in your brain that you're not even gonna be able to think for the test. So make sure and take some time for leisure activities and no stress, because you don't want too much stress. And wow, I just got serious for a second. Oh my god. Step 10! <laughs> I'm terrible at this, so I don't know why I'm telling you to do this because I don't follow my own. I'm trying to help you. Okay, I'm trying to help you. Make a schedule and make sure you go to class when you have your finals. And make sure you know when your finals are. And make sure you study for the right test before the right final. And, you know, you know, just, just, you know, yeah, just make a schedule. Alright guys, thank you for watching this video. I am stressed to no end. Next week is actually when I'm going to take my finals. So next week I'm going to be like... <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful in any way or if you thought I was kind of crazy. So you have to thumbs it up now. I put you in a box and you're, you can't get out of it. I'm sorry. Leave me a comment in the comment section telling me your least favorite and your most favorite subject in school if you have any. And most people say lunch. Be creative. Don't say lunch. If you're not already, make sure and subscribe to my channel because I make a video every Tuesday. There are some other things you can do. What? What is that? Tristan, what? You, what? What? I have a second channel and a collab channel and a Facebook and an Instagram and a Twitter and you should go do everything that you can to them because they like to be touched too. But other than that, I hope you have a great week and I'll see you next Tuesday. Bye! You little cutie cute cute. Peace.